Ah, it's nice to see MV Station finally coming together. Oh, yes. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode on the dog craft server. We're back over here at the base today. We're going to be getting some more work done. Thank you. I've not done a lot of filming on here for a little while, so it's good to get back into that. Got a lot of progress as a result to show you. Um, mainly on level 3 here. Um, <laughs> the zombie. Yeah, the base still has a bit of a mob problem, but oh well. <laughs> First of all, organization is getting slightly better. We now have an ender chest complete with um, blocks to make base building a lot easier to have them all at my disposal. Oh. We've got to say hi to tree. tree. <laughs> there we go. Hi, tree. <laughs> all right. So I've got a few things to show you. Um, first of all, the TWAD studio is up here now. Um, you might have seen this in a few of the, the TWAD recaps. Um, but, yeah, this is, this is the, the main view of the studio. And obviously, I don't show this side because it's a huge color clash, but I like it. <laughs> so yeah, this is the Todd studio here that Slime and I built. I kind of like it. I quite like the use of the crimson. Um, yeah, we've got this little um, kind of seating area out here. Um, yeah, it's it's cool. It, it'll, it'll go a little like lap loop around. You can kind of see. Yeah, I guess it's like, what would be the best way to describe it? It's just kind of like a little overhang in the thing, um, which is cool. So yeah, let's, let's, let's get on with the, the rest of the MP <laughs> tour. Okay, so if we continue over this way, like I said, we have this little area. We now are starting to build up this area. This is still very much a work in progress. We're starting to get some things going. We're starting to work this area out. We have another little extra level here that kind of goes up to here. A little viewing area, and this kind of looks out of, onto the stairway that hops out to that area. So it, it's honestly kind of cool. Um, I love seeing um, MB slowly expand. Don't know what we'll do here. We'll try and do something here, but overall, starting to shape up. And this uh, third floor is actually looking kind of cool. We're, we're going away a little bit from just like the main superstructure down here, because obviously the the last one was kind of like you had the lower floor and you had the superstructure wrapped around here. We're we're kind of ditching that slightly now. And it's, Going for a similar thing, but not quite. Also, let's let, let's head out over here, because there's this building here, and honestly, it doesn't look particularly good. But there's a reason for that, okay? It's because this building was built in 2016, and you may be like, "Moderator, you're crazy." Um, how how was this built in 2016? It, it can't have been. It, it literally must have just been built in like the past week or something. Probably the uh, past month or something by the time you're watching this. <laughs> But no, this build was built in 2016. I mean, yeah, it was just built yesterday. Um, but it's a recreation of my Sir One house. Um, yeah, so it's, it's as accurate as possible. It is flipped on its uh, flipped 90 degrees, uh, so it's slightly different. But oh my goodness, replica of Mondinator's Sir One home from December 2016 to September 2017. I've not done the interior yet and I will do more, um, but overall it's so cool to see this thing um, back in the flesh again. Uh, even, I mean, it's not terrible for like, what, four years ago now? Going on four years ago, um, it's not terrible. Okay, so yesterday I got myself a tag. I, I got tagged. <laughs> I got tagged. That that's a shame. But I I didn't even know what this was. But clearly this is some sort of tag that's been going around. The one and only official tag in fifty two. Tag you're it, you fool. Okay. <laughs> so I was told by Equinox, who she gave it to me the uh, yesterday, that I cannot give it to anyone else until the next day. And guess what? It's the next day. <laughs> So who would be my victims to tag? Well, I noticed that TXP, Trainer, Tiger, Roger and Jared were all around the Alien area. So I thought if I could get one of them isolated on their own, that would make the perfect tag. So off I went to Alina.
rumbled. Oh, there's skellies there. You need to be stealthy. You need to be stealthy, okay? Okay. They're all in the conference room. How are you to get in there? <laughs> After waiting for about 15 minutes, my patience paid off and only Roger was left on his own. Ah, uh -huh, Roger's still on a leader. And he's on his own. Ha ha ha. Right, okay. Oh, Jesus. Okay, no. Where is he? Is it there? Is it in there? Oh, my God. <gasps> There's Jess. There's Jess. <laughs> go, 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 go. <laughs> For the past couple of weeks, my main focus is tying up loose ends on the server. And this is probably the loosest of the end. <laughs> this is M Bay Station. Um, and what has really motivated me to get going again with this is because poor Dragon uh, has been waiting to connect this up to Gaia for so long. <laughs> and I feel really bad for uh, Dragon. But, but the station is... Um, more or less exteriorly finished. We need to do these these bits here, uh, the, the glass roofs and stuff. Um, but the interior is an absolute mess, and that's what I'm trying to figure out right now, is do that sort of stuff. Another thing I thought I would do, again, I started doing it like a little while ago, but it starts seeing the dates because my stuff is really backlogged, so it'd be kind of cool for you guys to see what date this was filmed and um, so today is the 7th of october 2020 um yeah which is awesome and it's, it's nearly halloween there's some big things in the pipe work for halloween i know that um and i can't wait to uh, hear more about that there is a skin competition going on but right now um i've never considered myself a skin making aficionado so I'm probably not going to go in for that. It would be embarrassing if I, if I did, but um, I guess, I, I mean, I could go in for it because um, you do get a head for participation, but is it worth embarrassing my artistic skin pixelation skills for a head? I mean, probably. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see what happens. But um, yeah, overall, we're starting to get somewhere with this. As you can see, what we're doing here... Um, we're getting there, we're also trying to um, replicate this on this side. Hi. Most, master of modern building. Oh, I mean, I wouldn't say master, but I, I, I've done my fair share of it. Yeah, you did a great job so far. So, and I loved the uh, loved the color. That's yeah. why. And See, like you said, blue exactly. is always blue. <laughs> is is very good because, especially with the Nether update, there are so many blue blocks now. Oh, I didn't even think about yeah, the like, wood. All the warp oh, stuff as well, oh. it, it might work really well. But yeah, because you got your, your concretes, the prismarine, all the warped nether blocks. It, it's lots of choice. Yep. And I kind of use all of them in MB. I don't really just use a specific set. I just yep. normally use all blue blocks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, my problem is because you've seen how I usually build. It's mostly small scale and yeah, I don't have to yeah. worry about a big flat spot exactly yeah and a skyscape raper is nothing but a flat wall exactly it's much. big and flat and tall <laughs> so you can't do an intricate 
pattern on this thing, and that's what I'm struggling with. <laughs> yeah, yeah, normally what I do is I try and focus on maybe like breaking it up into segments. That's the best yep. thing I normally do, like making another framework. Uh, normally I like to use my grey concrete, like my light grey or my normal grey, and it kind of breaks up quite a lot. Because you can see yeah. M Bay Station, um, it, it, it's got lots of different bits. It's got kind of the big arch bit, it's got like the main bit as well. It's kind of lots of different patterns that I use. But the shape on this, this is fantastic. <laughs> yeah, I came up with it in school. I was born. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. I mean, it must have taken so long to build in survival. It's such Not a... really. It's really? About one and a half hours. That's not for too this bad. Frame. Yeah, I had the idea and knew what I wanted to do, so... Awesome. But yeah, I mean, honestly, I think someone of your your talent, like, you're a fantastic <laughs> builder. I think, I think you'll be able to do something. Well, so hopefully I've been able to help you a little bit. Yep. <laughs> Give you some really. advice. I'm, I'm gonna use the grey and then try to figure something out. <laughs> Well, good luck. Good luck. I'm sure it'll look yeah, great thanks. when it's done, though. All right. Yeah, well, have a nice hopefully. day, then. Bye. Bye. You too. <laughs> oh, it's always good fun. It's always good fun. Oh, that, that was good. That was good. Hopefully, um... Hopefully, I had a little bit of help there. Um, I mean, it's kind of... It's, it's weird, because I feel like, um... He's such... So much more... Such a better builder than me. So much better at building, but it's a different style and stuff. So I don't know. I don't know. I mean, maybe I've helped him a little bit. MB is just quite a modest base, but I guess it looks it looks kind of cool. 